Hey, what's up, you two? This is Old here, here, coming at you with a quick little, uh, kind of like something interesting. Um, I told you guys a couple days ago that I was going to do a, like a walk around or a walkabout for my truck. Um, but what I wanted to show you guys was, like I showed you guys on my vlog, or my EDC a couple weeks ago, um, is my Vibrams, or Vibrams, or however you want to say it, um, Five Fingers, these ones right here, these are the Komodo Sports, um, Komodo Sports, I love these things with a passion, they stink though, I haven't washed them. Um, but here in Michigan, it's been raining all day, and I wore these today. And the problem is, out by my truck, there are puddles, and there were puddles in the parking lots that I was walking through, and stuff like that. Um, so, for Father's Day, to kind of backtrack a little bit, for Father's Day, uh, I bought my dad a boot dryer. Um, now it says, don't tumble dry, or let... They have Vibrams. Don't tumble dry the Vibrams. Um, let them air dry. Hang them up. Put them outside. Set them in the sun. Put them in front of a fan. Um, so because these are wet. All the way up to the toe. And air doesn't escape through the sole. What I did was I took and I put them on my dad's boot dryer. Just like this. And I set it. I don't know how long I set it for. But I put it so there's no heat. See, there's the heat, no heat. I don't know if you guys can actually see that. And then the timer, and it does gloves and boots as well. Um, so I just put it on here, set them on here for 90 minutes, I think I did. Um, just letting them dry. I have probably half hour left or so, um, but I'm just letting them dry, letting the air come all the way up to the toes, um, if anything, what I'll do next, if they're not dry by the time I go to work, I'll take them off, let them air dry, and probably run them again after work, um, and then again, I might just run them before work again, I don't know, um, but about that walk around on my truck, I'm kind of... I kind of want to um, get some things for it. I my radio it doesn't have an aux, so I kind of I don't want to say I ghetto rigged away because I didn't. But if you remember way back when iPods were big, um, like it was a second generation iPod classic. Um, my aunt had one. It was like 180 gigs or something like that. The thing was as big as... It was as thick as a wallet. I mean, the thing was huge. Anyways, you used to put this thing in your cigarette lighter, and you tuned it to a certain station. Turn, you tuned that little thing to a certain station, and then you tuned your radio to that same exact station, and it would somehow play through um, your cigarette lighter into your radio. It was magic. Um, don't know why I'm tired. Only got five hours of sleep tonight. Um, or last night. But I got one of those, uh, for the truck. So, I want to put a new radio in it. That's probably going to be a while down the road. Um, let me see what else. I want to put a tonneau cover on it. That's probably going to be a while down the road as well. Um, a toolbox. Or bed box, whatever you want to call it. Tool, bed box, bed toolbox. I don't know what you want to call it. Um, I want to put one of those on it. Uh, what else, what else, what else? Now, I've only had the thing for about two days. Right? Two? Saturday, Sunday, Monday? Yeah, two days. And, um... 
I love it. I have no complaints about it except for the fact that the radio doesn't have an aux jack in it. Um, I'm very big into music. So if I don't have my music, which is all on my phone, which I'm recording with right now, I am lost. Now, one of the, I do have... <clears throat> I do have a CD player. I just don't feel like taking and putting a bunch of, or all of my music onto however many CDs I need. Um, plus, it'll get old after a while, playing, hearing the same thing on the same exact track every single time. You know, I, I want some randomness to it. That's why I enjoy listening it to it with my phone, is I just... Oh, I'm so sorry. I just take and I select random, and I just let it play through. And whatever song comes up next, comes up next. So, uh, I still haven't decided really what I want to do. Um, another thing is I want to try and work on some interior lighting stuff. Um... It's very dark in that cab, and uh, so I gotta work out a way. <clears throat> I gotta work out a way to, without turning my cabin light on or my map light or reading light or whatever you want to call it, on. I have to figure out how to put lighting in there. <sighs> Sorry, guys. How to put lighting in there? So I can actually see the different crevices that I have to put change in or put just random stuff in or, you know. So it's all a work in progress right now. Um, hopefully it'll be sometime <sighs> this week I'll be doing it. Um, I'm working all night shifts all week, so it'll probably be... Wednesday, if it's not raining. Thursday, if it's not raining. Or Friday, if it's not raining. Um, but yeah. So I think that's it for this vlog, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, I'll probably be D B B D B D D D. I can't talk today. I'll probably be doing something on my V rooms as well. Um, let me see. I also have. This knife to review, my Gerber Tanto, fast quick draw, quick draw Tanto, I really do love the handle on this thing, I love the blade on it, partially serrated, Tanto edge, um, so I got to do a review on this, I have a flashlight I want to do a review on, uh, what else? <sighs> yeah, I'm going to wrap it up. Thanks again for watching, guys. It's been one Antio. Peace out. Only two, three, two. Peace.